Yo, what is good, chat? Today, we will be showing you how to make a full working executor using Silt API, which is our API, to get to get um our API. You want to go to getsilt.com. You want to scroll down all the way to the bottom. Press download. We also have a paid and free executor that you can get either. The paid version is in getsilt.com. Free is just in the Discord here that you can just download here. Um, and the paid version to get the key is in the um, paid Discord, which is really cheap. Both links will be down down in the description. And lifetime is only 700 Robux. One month, 500. A week, 200. Really cheap for such a clean and fast UI it's also internal and external and 98% SUNC this yeah um all right so first what you want to do is go open visual studio and then go to winforms.net framework and then press next then you want to name it um whatever you want Press create. Now I'm not going to be doing too advanced UI, but yeah, I'll just do something okay. So I'm just going to get rid of this. Alright, first thing we're going to do is add the API. So right click reference, add reference, browse, and then download this. We'll put this in. And then go back to silk. Copy this, double click your code, and put that just here, and then copy app manifest, go into it, and then right click this, add form, and you want to find app location manifest file, add that, and then just replace this line with it. Next is attach API. So we're gonna we're gonna use gunner buttons just because they look a lot better. So set up gunner and then install that. Accept. And now that that's installed, you wanna search up button. Gonna do button. Yeah. Um, it's alright. Thanks. That's all right. And then you, I'm gonna change the background color to black. Change this to like a 14, 14, 14. Actually, wait, this one. 14, 14, 14. I'm gonna make the text say execute. Now we're also gonna make the text say so you are black 12, just like that. The border radius 2 with an outline of white. Border thickness 2, you know, 1. Make this 5. Okay. And I'm just gonna copy and paste that right here. Make this inject. Make it a bit smaller. And we're also gonna have what else we're we gonna have. Open file and save file. So <laughs> open. <coughs> and then we're gonna also download a thing called web view and it should be this one microsoft.web.webview okay 
Now, what you gotta do is go to debug, debug properties, go to build, do x64. That will get rid of the warning down there. Put in your web view and then drag it to your other size. We're also gonna have a text label. Full color white. We're gonna make that circle UI bold. And then we're just gonna make it test. Also another button. Another button just for close and open. I mean close and minimize. So X. Okay, now for the coding. Hang on, let's make this make this twenty. Okay. So and also we're gonna make a ellipse. Border radius ten uh what do you five basically? Form one meter. Now the corners are not squared. Now with the code. We're gonna go to close all this. Just so we so it's organized. First what you wanna do is we're gonna start with execute. So go to copy execute double click on your execute code and then do editor dot oh, editor dot text and then rename your web view to editor there we go. touch API so now we're gonna go to inject Oh wait, no, 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 no. We're gonna make, we're gonna put it like right there. Put this to inject. And then, um, copy this in the editor thing. So, editor interrogate, integrate. Integrate, <laughs> and then just do the same thing, and then up here do initialize async, and then edit it clear. Oh, yeah, I forgot to add a clear button, so do clear. Let's put that there. Editor and open file. Just put that there. And then open open file. Is it open file? Clear active tab. Okay. And then edit a clear. Okay, we've done that. And what's this window? Hang on, let me just get the. Yeah, that's right. Oh yeah, editor for web view. Oh yeah, that's uh, async. <laughs> and then 
What else are we missing? Let's just see how this looks. Oh, we need to restart. Don't mind that. That was a previous video. Alright. See how this goes. Oh wait, yeah, that's right. We need to... So... When you download this, it'll download a bin. I've already got it downloaded, so... Which is this. You want to copy both of these. Go to your... Bin, debug, and then paste it right here. Replace. Perfect. And then... And then that should work. Look at that. So good. Clear. Works. Oh, I need to code all that stuff. So, this... Wait, no. Application.exit. This... So, win... Form... Windows state equals form min minimized. Okay, so and for open and save, you want to go back to the website, go to the website, copy editor open and save file, go back to your code, and just Oh, I've already got it here. And then just backspace, backspace. And rename this to open file. Wait, no. You don't, you don't have to rename that. You're meant to do this open file here. And then go to your save and just do save file. And that's it. Now, on the save file, you're going to have two errors. What you want to do is just do two brackets, and inside that bracket, just do string. And that's it. And then for this, just delete that. And that should be it. Now let's test it. See if everything works. Um, clear. Yep. Open. Yep. Save, yep. Okay, and also I forgot to. Um, I forgot that I'm using a web view, so the execute code is different. So I'm just gonna get the code from my executor. Um, and then this will be in the. This code will be in the free Discord, so. Um, this is ace. Okay, and now we test. So this this code will be in the free Discord, which will be in the um, link in the description. So let's go ahead and test this. And just text executor, and then we run this. We should have run it as admin, which is default. So let's inject. And then... Look at that. It works. So just clear, open, save, minimize. A really good simple executor and yeah looks really good well, not really good but you know for the start of beginners you guys can always work on this and yeah hope you guys have a if you guys okay if you guys have any questions put it in comment make sure to sub like and yeah join the discord for the execution code See you guys in the next one.